The blue whale, Balaenoptera musculus, is an awe-inspiring creature. It holds the title of the largest animal on Earth. This gentle giant, with its immense size and graceful movements, captivates the imagination. The blue whale story is one of wonder and resilience. For centuries, these magnificent creatures roamed the oceans. They were abundant in almost every ocean. Sadly, human activities, particularly whaling, brought them to the brink of extinction. Today, thanks to conservation efforts, their numbers are slowly recovering. The blue whale's story is a powerful reminder of the interconnectedness of life on Earth. It highlights the importance of protecting our planet's biodiversity. Join me as we delve into the world of the blue whale. Let's explore its life, its challenges and the hope for its future. The blue whale's size is truly remarkable. Imagine an animal as long as three school buses lined up end to end. That's how long a blue whale can grow, reaching up to 100 feet in length. Their weight is equally impressive. A blue whale can weigh as much as 200 tons, equivalent to about 33 elephants. Their bodies are long and streamlined, perfectly adapted for life in the water. Their skin is smooth and mostly grey-blue in colour, often with a mottled pattern. When they swim near the surface, the sunlight filtering through the water can make them appear blue. Despite their massive size, blue whales are surprisingly agile. They are powerful swimmers, capable of reaching speeds of up to 20 miles per hour. They have a large tail fin that propels them through the water with ease. Blue whales are found in all oceans around the world. They prefer deeper waters, often far from coastlines. These gentle giants are constantly on the move, following their food source. They undertake long migrations, traveling thousands of miles each year. In the summer months, blue whales migrate to colder, nutrient-rich waters near the poles. These areas teem with krill, their primary food source. As winter approaches, they head towards warmer waters near the equator to breed and give birth. Blue whales rely on their keen sense of hearing to navigate the vast ocean depths. They communicate with each other using a complex series of low-frequency sounds. These sounds can travel for hundreds of miles underwater. Section 4. A Whale's Appetite, Feeding and Diet Blue whales are baleen whales, meaning they lack teeth. Instead, they have baleen plates in their mouths, which are fringed structures made of keratin, the same material as human fingernails. These plates act like a giant sieve, filtering food from the water. Their diet consists mainly of krill, tiny shrimp-like crustaceans that swarm in massive numbers. To feed, a blue whale opens its mouth wide and takes in a huge gulp of water along with thousands of krill. They then use their powerful tongue to push the water out through the baleen plates, trapping the krill inside. A single blue whale can consume up to 40 million krill in a day. This incredible feeding capacity is essential for sustaining their massive size and energy requirements. Section 5. The Circle of Life Reproduction and Migration Blue whales typically reach sexual maturity between the ages of 5 and 15 years old. Their breeding season occurs during the winter months when they migrate to warmer waters. During this time, males compete for the attention of females, often engaging in displays of strength and agility. After mating, the female carries her calf for about 10 to 12 months. Blue whale calves are born tail first and are already enormous at birth, measuring around 25 feet long and weighing up to 3 tons. The mother nurses her calf for about 6 to 7 months, providing it with rich, fatty milk that helps it grow rapidly. The bond between a mother and calf is incredibly strong. The mother stays close to her calf, protecting it from predators and teaching it essential survival skills. It takes about two years for a calf to become fully independent. Section 6. A Species on the Brink. Whaling and Conservation. For centuries, blue whales roamed the oceans relatively undisturbed. 
However, the advent of modern whaling in the late 19th century brought these gentle giants to the brink of extinction. Their immense size and blubber, which was highly prized for its oil content, made them prime targets for whalers. By the mid-20th century, blue whale populations had been decimated. It is estimated that over 300,000 blue whales were killed during this period. The International Whaling Commission finally granted them full protection in 1966, but by then, their numbers had plummeted to dangerously low levels. Section 7. The Future of the Blue Whale Our Shared Responsibility The story of the blue whale is a stark reminder of the impact human activities can have on the natural world. However, it also offers a glimmer of hope. Thanks to conservation efforts, blue whale populations are showing signs of recovery, albeit slowly. The International Union for Conservation of Nature, IUCN, still lists blue whales as endangered. It is crucial that we continue to protect them from threats such as entanglement in fishing gear, ship strikes, and habitat degradation. Reducing pollution and mitigating the effects of climate change are also essential for their long-term survival. The future of the blue whale, and indeed all marine life, depends on our collective action. By supporting conservation efforts, reducing our environmental footprint, and spreading awareness about these magnificent creatures, we can help ensure that the blue whale continues to grace our oceans for generations to come. Subscribe to our channel to stay updated on the latest in marine conservation and join us in making a difference.